lesson, we're going to look at how to create an eye-catching cover. The first thing we see of your video is the cover. So a good cover helps encourage people to click on your video. Let's look at how to create a cover. One way we can do this is to choose a frame to use as the cover. Tap the cover button to the left of the video track to bring up the cover picker. Swipe the video so the white bar is aligned with the frame you want to use. Next, tap Add Text to add a title. Now tap Save in the top right to save the cover you just created. Another way to do it is to upload a cover you've already created. Tap Upload and choose a photo from your phone album to use as the cover. The last way to do it is to use a CapCut template. First, swipe the video to select the frame you want to use. Next, tap the Use Template button below and select a template from a category such as trending, fashion, or food. For our video, we'll select a template from the fashion category. Tap one you like and you'll see the text laid out in the preview. Tap the text to delete, copy, enlarge, shrink, or move it. Double tap the text to edit it or change the style. We looked at text styles in lesson 6, so we won't go over it again here. Once you've edited the text, tap the check mark on the right and then tap save in the top right to save your cover. If you're not happy with your edits, just tap reset to reset the template. Now that the cover is done, we're ready to export the video. To ensure that the final video is good quality, we suggest that you tap the 1080p button before exporting your video. By default, CapCut exports videos with 1080 pixels and at 30 frames per second. If you shot your video in 4K at 60 frames per second, you can change the resolution and frame rate to get the best quality video. Once you're done, you can tap the export button and CapCut will save the video to your phone album. There's also an option to post your video directly to TikTok or another social media site. And that's all for the CapCut Start Editing course. We hope you've learned some video editing techniques that you can apply to your own videos to help make them even better than before. We're going to create more courses in the future, so watch this space. Congratulations on completing the course and taking the first step in your video editing journey.